So, mm-hmm. uh, but I will walk, make you a walk through to, to some of our SAP. Uh, this is a uh, resident SAP uh, uh, certification material, which will okay. help us. So this is what topic by topic I will be following in the in the entire uh, process. <coughs> Excuse me. This is the CRM summary, like which we are uh, trying to uh, work. So can you see my screen? Yes, yes, I can. Yep. Uh, where like we have this uh, service, sales, uh, marketing. So that means when you are uh, working in these areas, this system will help you to integrate them together. Okay. It will help us uh, to have an internal intra communication. First of all, to serve our customer better. So internally, we should be communicative, isn't it? So like mm-hmm. when when uh, when the CRM uh, business starts, uh, you can see. Let's see. So if we try to divide this into chapters, like how many chapters, such chapters are there, like such topics or chapters are Basically it comes with areas. customization. I'll show you the, all the stuff which is available. You can see this, mm-hmm. CR 100, yes, sir. Yes. customization, 300 sales, sales yeah. 410 web client, yes. uh, part of uh, uh, 580, that's called web UI mm-hmm. marketing service. This, okay. is, this is how you can say. Sales service marketing is, yes. okay. Yeah. The core things are marketing, service, sales. So yes. these are all Windows. Web client is something like which uh, interaction center, call center uh, uh, related module. Okay. That's how it is. <clears throat> so, uh, so uh, completely, uh, completely. That's what uh, that was your question, right? Yeah. So no, like, if we, for example, if no, we start so from you have typed that question. That uh, what do we do in SAP? There is something. Could you explain about SAP? No, no. I said like, how many such chapters are there? Like, if I have to divide my next. Yeah, these are the chapters. Okay. Uh, these yeah. are the chapters like uh, uh, service, marketing, uh, interaction center, web client, CRM sales. So these are the see the diagram. What I'm showing you, the sum that is the summary like of topics. Only. If you can see okay. this, Just this is one topic. Okay. This is one field, and for all these things, there is something called base customization. Okay. That right. you're talking about IMG, oh. right? Yeah, IMG is implementation guide. That is that is those are interfaces, and okay. this is these are modules. These are modules. The okay. summarization of CRM. So when we talk about IMG, IMG is this. This is what customization we call it as. Okay. So you will be expected to know the customizations within the CRM. <coughs> <laughs> when we talk about a customer relationship management, definitely they will ask you how to customize, isn't it? Are you sure? And no programming involved. This is the this this would be the big uh, 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 business secret of uh, people who are coming from non-programming background who can survive here. Okay, yes, that's a good part actually. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, that is how we, see. I'm I'm a mechanical engineer, so like by default, how I came into this this functional area is because I like the client interactions and client communication a lot. And I want to get into, and you know, it's an 80-20. SAP's beauty is 80% is non, it is a default functionality. Mm-hmm. I don't need to touch the 80% part of SAP. Not so really, yeah. whatever is required, between 5 to 20%, I have to customize. Okay. So that's what the customization of SAP, and it is well-structured and organized uh, uh, kind of thing. Uh, uh, 
<clears throat> we we generally uh, have uh, the the program non programming mechanism the nuts and bolts of uh, SAP CRM and uh, so the settings in the SAP system that are used to adjust the default functions so that is how uh, that is how you have to generally understand so how the SAP uh, mechanism works and how the uh, customization works so your part is mainly to customize but i said when it is customizing it is 80 20 okay so 80 percent is default and your basic functional skill till today will come handful okay. uh, when it is uh, coming to sap uh, uh, crm customization mm -hmm. uh, so as i said this default functionality of sap crm has been built after after studying more than 300 to 400 uh, different varied verticals then sure. they've designed this product so that clients who buy the CRM license will have uh, the maximum possible 80 to 85 percent default functionality without changing they can use it mm -hmm. but we, we guys will go there to just extend the application we'll never do the implementation from scratch Yes. Okay. That's 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 the beauty of SAP CRM or any SAP related functional module. No, that way I've done some like gone on internet, done some research, and I'm like actually confident that I want to take this SAP CRM only. That's like kind of decided. Like no, it's decided over the CRM module. Yeah. Like, as such, yeah, CRM model is I've decided because this suits my kind of background. Although I'm not from technical, but still have business of marketing and sales. Mm, and so so this is knowledge. Uh, see, yes, coming to CRM uh, because. Uh, the world never ends for CRM because all the the uh, the e-shopping related activities, uh, the online payment, the e-service related activities. Even today, from automobile to telecom to to utilities like power, gas, water, all are dependent on CRM. Yeah, it's actually ever increasing, right? Yeah, day by day, it is. Got not got say that it is because as long as the consumer industry grows, so from the retail to telecom. Uh, and that never ends, isn't it? So, so yes. obviously, CRM is going to become. See, CRM is not a, just a software or something like which is like tally or something. It is going to be a process-driven thing. It is going to be an economy-driven thing. So, uh, sure. and that's what I say. Like CRM uh, is going to live as long as what called customer lives. <laughs> yeah, true. So, so, it's not going to die today or tomorrow. So many people ask how long the CRM is going to exist. This CRM is there from civilizations, so it's yes. not today's uh, uh, mechanism like what we are talking about. So uh, coming to the uh, the the customer, as I said, the three interfaces customizing mm -hmm. which I've discussed. Uh, yes. This is one, and uh, the part two will be GUI. That's called a graphical user interface. Okay. So now, uh, so in the next session, I'll be showing you the login and uh, and how to uh, some small samples so where we start the when you start the class. Okay. okay. So, because I could not uh, start to my office from my home because as, uh, it was early yeah, Today's fine. Like, today is okay. That's okay because yeah. once I decide, like, hopefully. Like, yeah. I would like to see the initial session itself. I would like to take them to the walkthrough because, you know, uh, I don't believe in just presenting. I just wanted to show you the, the hands-on thing. So that no, actually, this is this works better because I want to have more discussion about the course and the content. Oh, and okay. Content your presentation. Okay. I'm confident that like once we start and it will be okay and we can start everything from the first class once I decide. Absolutely. But yeah, yeah. That, uh, this that is sounds fine good. Because in fact as long as you're answering my queries uh, that's more than enough for me for today. <laughs> yes, yes. No, it's, it's a discussion more than you know we are not kids right and either you yes. are just a uh, college writer like where you exactly uh, doesn't do anything about CRMs or ERP. You are already yes. in actually. You know the, yes. the only difference between uh, uh, you and me is uh, I have traveled along with a lot of information technology related aspects and you traveled at the business side and we stand yeah, almost on the same yeah. side uh, on the same different boats but yes there is no uh, big uh, difference between both of us yes so one more because, question like if yeah. I uh, like do this seriously and give my hundred percent like how confident I will be after one and one and a half month to take on the job uh, I'll tell you uh, because some of the three things uh, people who have planned well uh, I, I had uh, such one guy coming from uh, uh, Lloyd's UK 
and he's a six sigma guy and uh, he knows how to utilize the time he knows how yes. to uh, take the practice and how best you know he made he made sure that he was in the forums across the world every day around 3 hours 4 hours he used to spend on forums and understand the crm internals how the interviews are what they are how do how do i how do i handle it because interviews are on the project perspective yes. the technicality is the, the more you see uh, generally uh, I, I generally say that SAP uh, CRM works with three stages. First is the concept, second is the analysis, the third is the hands-on. Mm -hmm. So you, the first two things, the concept and analysis you are going to become, because because of your business skills, you are, it's going to be uh, a very, very uh, easy job for you. Okay. Because analyzing doesn't require any practice. That means, I, see, I don't want SAP or Oracle, these products don't spend your time in the navigation. Yes. Spend more time in the understanding the components, the architecture. So I, I say that when you start the class without knowing the architecture, don't go into the topics. Don't go into the business. First know because it is the skeleton of this SAP system. Yes. What, what web application server we have. What uh, 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 particular NetWeaver application, how what it does, so how the database is, how the basis is. So if you know them, so from there, uh, rest will be the history. But many people, uh, what they do is, they only concentrate on topics, like how we do in the college. Yes. If we are going to learn topic by topic, only the steps, ultimately when you go to the interview, they say that if, if they ask you, uh, uh, what is uh, segmentation, they'll say that SPRO, CRM, marketing, click on segmentation, create target group. I'm not asking you that. So I don't want the uh, the navigation path. So tell me how the segmentation happens in the, in the market. On what basis it takes place. So give me a business example first. That's how the interview starts. Okay. SAP interview is not something like uh, you're telling uh, 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 your IMG paths and uh, uh, that is written everywhere. That is. Even if I blog on the internet, I'll get that uh, path. True. Because what what SAP can do systematically, don't explain me. Even if you are wrong or if you are not able to, uh, some, sometimes, you know, when I take it, I say that I don't mind even if you don't tell the paths in a sequence. Because system has all those things there. You'll search for two minutes or three minutes and you'll get into it. But if you don't have the business process knowledge, of, of anything, yes. You even if you get the path, you can't do anything. You got, you cannot get me the result. Yes. You can only uh, walk through the system. So that's where do understand that the business knowledge, people who have business knowledge, can catch up this within very short time. I'm saying the, about this Lloyd's guy. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. He's come from UK. Within 20 days he has got his offer letter. Wow. And mark my word, he did not even practice well, but he has uh, gone into a lot of brainstorming things across, he used to go to internet, he used to discuss with me on uh, like how it happens, and people who are practicing, everybody's posting questions on a lot of forums and uh, blogs, isn't it? Like yes, the community are. network is there. So that is how we get into see, you are sitting somewhere in Canada at home, uh, you once you want to get into uh, some uh, ex experienced people and some people who are practicing like you, so you can see if there are some silly questions you have to leave it, but serious questions which are answered, which they are. That means you can buy an experience of one year of struggle of some people within short time as an experienced guy. Yeah, makes sense. Uh, so, so that's what I say. You have all the world of time with you, spend it, and but yes, plan your practice. That means sure. the time, what you're spending on SAP, online, on the system, it should be very well articulated. So, otherwise, you know, what happens in this uh, IT courses, uh, we open the system, we do on, go on practicing, but at the end of the day, what did I do today? If I try to uh, analyze in my note that, yes, le let me write what I have done today, uh, sometimes it's amazing that nothing. It turns up into yes. nothing, but you have wasted a time of three to four hours. 
Yes. Because at, the, at this age, every second costs us. So <laughs> That's true. obviously, uh, obviously, all the things we should not lose time. You may lose anything, lose money, but don't lose time. So, so that's where you plan it uh, from now onwards. Like when you start the course, yes, this thirty days. This is my program, and you. I am going to go into these forums. The, the biggest forum is uh, SAP Community Network. <coughs> uh, that's that a SDN is, one. Like, yeah, SDN. It is now changed into Community Network. Earlier it was SAP Developers Network. Now they changed that format into. It's called Community Network now. Yeah, SCN. So as you said, like in interviews, these like questions are more from functional side and fundamental side rather than technical side. No, we cannot see. Basically, technical side, yes, you should have an overview. That means if they ask, you know, did you ever see a report? You should not say no. Yes. Did this? Do you know what a basis guy does? You should have a basic, at least an overview of what he does. Okay. So these are all things when we are going to discuss blogs, forums. Uh, the more interactive you are with the uh, uh, with the with the internet, um, actually, in the, because I, uh, uh, most of the uh, uh, people who are in business definitely they will be very strong in internet. So I don't need to tell you. Mm -hmm. So everything, every issue, every practice, what we do within the CRM. So it has to be very much interactive. Yeah, okay. today if I'm going to work on CR marketing, uh, what is CR marketing all about? All about it's acquiring uh, business to the uh, to the customer, to the to the company. No, acquiring more clients. So for that, what should I do? I should target some customers. How should I target? First of all, I have to segment them by income, by age, by region, isn't it? By the, yes. by the uh, buying uh, by the buying power of the customer. So how, from where I'm going to get the data? From where I'm going to get the leads? So if I if I draw a picture on a white paper, I can convert them into an SAP picture slowly. That conversion process is called uh, the the conceptualization of an SAP CRM consultant. He should start by closing his laptop, closing his uh, uh, book. If he's trying to write a one page of stuff about the flow, your half work is done. The next page should talk about, okay, the same thing, what am I doing in SAP? In a non-SAP format, if I want to uh, go to 10,000 customers, I should go into an Excel sheet and I have to shortlist them according to, uh, again, segregate them and it is going to take longer time. But when it is in SAP, everything is automated. Uh, you want a demographic picture, you'll, be, you'll get it. You, you want a, uh, you want a, uh, 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 the income level of the uh, uh, of the customers, income level customers, you'll get it. If you want to get age-based uh, customers, you'll, you'll get it. So it's all click away in in uh, in a CRM. So uh, generally, uh, uh, you have to understand SAP CRM runs in four areas. First is acquiring. Uh, uh, first is prospecting. Second is acquiring. Three is service. Four is retaining. These are the four challenges in the area of custom, uh, customer relationship management. Prospect, acquire, service, retain. Yes. That's it. Forget about uh, modules, what I'm going to do. So if you can think in this direction, your CR will be over. But obviously if you think in modules, you know, you'll think marketing separately and you'll think about interaction center separately, isn't it? Yeah, in a way. And in, in, for you, talk, if you talk about topics, so that's the reason the practice should be always with the process. Don't practice with topics actually. So suppose if I'm if I'm going to do uh, implement marketing, will I implement marketing without a channel, without an interaction mm -hmm. center? I cannot, is that? Yes, it? you cannot. Yes. Customers want to speak to us, and we have to follow up uh, follow up the customers. So this interaction center is automatically a channel. Without channel is a window. Marketing is a module. So the window without the window there is no house. So obviously the window or it's a door you can say more 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 specifically. That's where the entry is. The customer enters in. Right. So this is very when, when you see the entry and we you see the because this particular marketing is a house and this one is a door. 
So obviously, without a door, there is no house. So we cannot discuss separately. So when I'm talking about how, uh, talking about a house, then yes, there are doors and windows there. So obviously, when you talk, we, when you think in a business perspective, it's very easy to learn this subject. I say everything. Every question somebody will ask me in SAP CRM, I, I, my mind works in a business perspective. My many times, like uh, my colleagues uh, or my other people, just say, "How could how could you uh, uh, get back so fast on certain issues?" I say, "Like I get into the customer shoes as fast as possible. I don't want. I don't. I, I don't. I forget my company. I forget where I'm working, and I just get into his shoes and." Think about SAP or oh, SAP has these features. This, uh, getting into root cause is very important. So, if I don't have the the basics with me, right, uh, the concepts with me, the the I did not do the analysis of the CRM system, my basics will never be right. <coughs> Always I'll be struggling to get a get a solution. This is the difference between a successful and uh, so-called uh, consultants. So getting the fundamentals right is, right is very important. Absolutely. As I said, 80-20. Mm. If you are right in that 80, then only you can be right in the rest of the 20. You know, customization yes. is so vast, you will find 500 to 600 components there. Which one to do? Which one to start? That's what your concept will say that. Boss, like this is where it is and you are the, right now doing segmentation. Segmentation has target groups. If it doesn't know that, Segmentation has target groups. You will never touch that area, and obviously your segmentation doesn't work. Then you execute it fails. So and, uh, will drive sorry. you into the customization. Yeah, please go ahead. No, well, and I get access to this web UIs and GUI so that I can practice on that and yeah, you, you get, get hands-on. Complete access from us. Max will be giving you the, the entire. Uh, uh, connectivity uh, along with the codes. Whatever I'm working here and what you are working there, they'll be same system. Okay. And then you prepare for like resume preparation and then like interview <coughs> more questions and. My forum says everything. Like you, uh, because all the students at Mac like they put their questions because many people have a doubt that the once the class is over, faculty is not connected. He doesn't, uh, uh, because many times you can see in online, faculties don't uh, respond to the emails. Uh, that they, they are stuck. See, if you are stuck somewhere, you put it into my blog, I don't need to answer. I have my students who are going to the, they, who are uh, uh, the senior Mac students who are two steps ahead of you. They are doing their projects. Yeah, it's an active blog, yeah. Uh, so obviously, uh, they, these and I don't say that uh, all the answers in the blog are given by me. But yes, my the contribution around seventy percent will be mine. So okay. I will definitely. So, uh, so that's that is how I can uh, give, uh, I can promise you about the resume making, about how to make it, how to with what samples, how to project your uh, profile because your profile is not like a, a startup, right? Yes. The transition into SAP and how do you how did you enter into SAP? These all things would be questions when you go to interviews. And second thing is like I'm I'm just research I had researched the market in the past like and what I come across is they are only looking for some experienced guy. There's so many vacancies here in S for SAP CRM in Toronto, in Mississauga, in Ontario, in Calgary, in in entire Canada. I can say. Uh, but Canada is look, much into manufacturing sector. Supply chain related companies are too huge. Uh, so you definitely have a lot of SAP. Uh, the fastest hundred implementations they have done in any country that is Canada. SAP I'm talking mm -hmm. about. No, there are a so, lot of vacancies there, but only thing they look for some experienced guy, like for the see, one at least uh, one implementation cycle experience, and and that's a very vicious yeah. cycle to get in. It's a basic. See, it is an open secret that we have to prepare an experience because your past experience, what you have already shown. You have to show it in the consulting front. You know so something called core consultant. You have to initially say that I have joined, uh, I have started because Oracle already you had some experience, right? Yeah. The same experience you can show it in the SAP front. That means the the I am talking about the core business part. So you worked as a core consultant there. So you have to basically customize your CV, even to say right, because that's yes, how it yes. works. Yes, you 
that's an open secret to see uh, because if the every time the hr policies say that yes the candidate should have experience that is a that is a policy nobody can change but yes if you are skills are there we can customize the resume and we can get in there and survive and uh, obviously the business uh, uh, knowledge what you are going to have every bit of it will be reused okay hello yeah uh, and then so yeah. so that that's how it is uh, because as for the resume it is before, before knowing the customization of recipe you should know the customization of a resume okay <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's another customization i mean i need to do <laughs> absolutely it, <laughs> yeah. it is an open secret uh, yeah, especially I uh see i'll tell you see if you see the statistics the people are talking about enterprise automation talking about uh, uh, uh customer uh, uh, relationship automation but uh, why why don't you think that you know the sap industry attrition is not more than 2% uh, uh but uh, new clients uh, grow by 40% every quarter so from where this uh, 38% people are coming from <laughs> it is uh, obviously it's a it's a question uh, uh, Larry Ellison knows this the this the question which Narayan Murthy has so everybody has this question so <coughs> so obviously it is a hidden uh, agenda of all these heroes Bill Gates doesn't know it he knows it what happens in Microsoft India <laughs> that is true. That's so true. Oh uh, yeah. So I hope I answered most of your questions. No, no, you have yes. because <laughs> no, so like these left basic out, questions yes, I had. Still mail uh, Karthik. Uh, so the the yeah, you'll get a I'll get a CC of it, or okay. you can get into the forums. So obviously we we will be. See, I want to have a touch base mechanism with the candidates, and yes. uh training uh, canada candidate is not the first time so at max like we have people from canada from us very frequently yeah no like and the second if i start what is a suitable time like that's another question uh so kartik and you can come into uh, um, the discussion okay like that uh, i'm thinking like what time like you know should be appropriate for both of us uh morning is absolutely fine for me early morning for me i wake up at uh, around 5 so from okay. 5:30 to 7 am india ist is fine and uh, you 5 am your time means 6:30 here yeah and uh, the other uh, timing what right now i have is in the evening uh india evening yeah Your early morning so the uh, uh, my time at 6:30 pm in the 6:30 pm will be 5 am here yeah so 5 am or uh, is it okay for you to for like 7:30 pm 7:30 7:30 would be a little late because uh 6:30 uh, already i 6:30 or 7 is absolutely fine 7 pm in the evening my time 7 p.m. Okay. 7 p.m. means like 5:30 here, which should be okay. Yeah. No, yeah. 7, 7 p.m. PM means... is absolutely fine. No, I'm just thinking, if 7 p.m. for you, it should be 8:30 a.m. for me, right? It should because be. I'm... Yeah, uh, because I'm I'm just uh, I'm not having the clock now, so you can just check it out. Um, right now it's 8:30 there. there, right? Yeah, it's not... 8:30 exactly. No, it's at seven a.m. or yet, or like we are forward. We are forward for you, like one and a half hour, Anurag. Okay. Yeah, like whatever you said, that's right. Uh, if you are at seven p.m., that would be five thirty a.m. for you. Five thirty a.m. Yeah, for you, me. You you are late uh, for uh, one and a half hour. So it's like seven uh, a.m. right now. They are in India. Exactly. Seven a.m. Okay, so five thirty a.m. should be okay for me your time right yeah yeah it's uh, actually it's a little early but that's fine like if i have to manage it so <laughs> that's the best fine. time to learn things <laughs> <laughs> and then the worst time to get up actually <laughs> absolutely which you know you are definitely in a, not in a 
walking board or traveling these days you are uh, at home no 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 so, i'm okay i'm okay like i'm just kidding <laughs> like okay this is the only time i can actually utilize this and that's what i've kept it for me like for next one and a one and month or one month and half like mm, it, so, is, it is a, it is a career shift as well shift time yeah. so you definitely it is going to be a uh, after this i'm not going to get time.